Hi, friends. Welcome back from spring break for another week of digital learning. We missed you guys so much. Uh, it was great to see some of you on Zoom, but for those that I didn't see, I hope you had a very nice, restful, relaxing spring break, and you had an awesome Easter. You got to rejoice in the fact that he is risen, and maybe you got to share your resurrection eggs with your family, too, and maybe the Easter Bunny came and got you some cool treats. So um, this week, we are doing... Um, sorry, my girls are talking. We are doing the letter Y. So I'm going to do an alphabet craft with you. It is going to be a yak. But since yaks are usually brown, but since um, yellow is also a Y word, we're going to do a yellow yak. Okay, so all the supplies that you need for this is just a piece of paper. Um, I have a Sharpie, but you can use a black marker if you like. And then I'm gonna use a yellow crayon, but you can use a yellow marker or a yellow colored pencil. So that's it. Very simple um, supplies for this one. Okay, so to start our yak, we're gonna start drawing his face. So you want the paper to be sideways like this, not up and down, sideways. Then over on the side of your paper, you're gonna draw a line. This is gonna be his face. And then another line going down, just a little bit curved like that. Okay, at the bottom there, you're going to draw a big oval. That's going to be like his nose and mouth, like his muzzle. And then up here, on top of those two lines, let me see if you can see, you're going to draw some squiggly lines here going all around and make his hair. Because he's got shaggy hair, he's got like bangs. And then, I didn't leave much room. At the top of these, you're gonna draw his horns coming out. So he's gonna have two horns, just like that coming out. Okay, now for his body, you wanna start right about here on his head. And then you're gonna draw a big hump coming down and stop when you get about here. And then you're gonna go all the way out back down here, okay? Then from his muzzle here, you're gonna go down Take a line. That's about the same length as this one right here. Now you want to connect these two, and just like his hair, how I did those squiggly lines there, I'm going to do big ones down here. That's going to be his fur. Okay. Next, I'm going to give him four legs. So for the legs, I'm just going to do some rectangles. Two rectangles up front. And then two rectangles in the back. Then I'm going to do a line towards the bottom, and these are going to be his hooves. So I have lines at the bottom. I'm going to color those in. And now we're going to go back and do his face. First, I'm going to color in his horns. Let's make those black. You can make these any color you want, but I'm doing black, so we only have two colors here. Okay. Now I'm going to give him two eyes right there. And now in the oval part, you're going to give him two nostrils. They've got some pretty big nostrils that you see. Those are the whole, whole openings in your nose. And then give him a smile. Okay, so there is your yak. So next, I'm going to take my yellow. I'm going to color in his head, his hair on his head right there. And then I'm going to color in his whole body. I'm going to get behind these horns over here and around all on the side. And I'm going to color his whole body yellow. Oh, I forgot to give him a tail. Okay, let's get your black again. You're going to come over to the the back side right over here. You're gonna draw two lines down, and then I'm gonna draw, uh-oh, my paper doesn't wanna cooperate. A little fuzzy tail, just like that, if you can see. And then I'm gonna color that yellow too. We don't need to color his legs because we wanna have his legs a different color. I don't know if you guys can see that color. My lighting isn't too good today. So there we have our yellow yak. Now I'm going to write the words yellow yak at the top of your paper. So just like Miss Claire said, to draw a Y, we're going to start at the top 
and we're going to do a diagonal line about halfway down. Okay, then we're going to go to the other side at the top and we're going to draw a diagonal line going all the way down. There's your Y. Okay, next we're going to draw an E, straight line with top, middle, bottom, and then an L, straight line with a line at the bottom. Okay, now we're going to do another L, straight line with a line at the bottom. Then an O, and then a W, which is our letter a few weeks ago. Start at the top, diagonal line down, up, down, up. There we have our word yellow. Next, we're going to write the word yak. So once again, we're going to do a Y. We're going to start at the top and do a half a diagonal line down, and then go to the other side, diagonal line all the way down. Make sure those two are touching. Then an A, start at the top, go down, then go back up to that point, go down the other way, connect it in the middle. And now for a K, we're gonna go straight line down, come over to the other side, and then diagonal line to the middle, and then a diagonal line down. And there you have your yellow yak. Oh, it's cute. All right, friends, um, thank you for watching this. Um, we will be talking soon, coming out with some more crafts and more things. Um, I will see, hopefully, all of you at the Zoom meeting on Thursday. If not, I hope you have a wonderful week and enjoy the beautiful day. Bye, friends.